Hey everyone, I'm Megan Remblack and welcome to my channel, Meg Rem Softball. Here's a video on what I do daily with my infielders. So I call these my dailies. I do this before every lesson, before every practice with my girls, and before every game. Uh, this helps us get warmed up. It helps us feel what our hands should be doing, gets our hands loose. Um, it helps us feel what our body should be doing. So how we start, you're gonna be on your knees, no glove. I'm a righty, so I'm, I'm gonna be using my glove hand, uh, which is my left hand. Partner's gonna roll me a ball, straight on. All I'm doing is going to meet the ball. My fingertips are down, my wrist is flat. I'm going to meet that ball. Once I feel that ground ball, my eyes are behind my hand. I'm pausing for about a second, and then I'm gonna roll it back. So when I give lessons, it's just one girl. I'm rolling it to them. They're tossing it back in the air to me. If you have a team you can or a partner, uh, have the partner right across from you so you guys can roll back and forth. So you're gonna go five straight on, and then you're gonna roll it or toss it back. Once you get your five, now we're gonna be going to your glove side. So for me, I'm a righty, it's to my left side. Same thing, partner's just gonna roll a little bit to my left. I'm gonna field it, go meet it. My chest is down, my back is flat, my fingertips are down, and my eyes are behind my hand. And I'm gonna roll it back, I'm gonna do five there. Then I'm going backhand. Same thing, chest down, back flat, my fingertips are down, my palm is to the ball, and I have some bend in my elbow. Partner's gonna roll it a little bit to my right. I'm gonna feel those, pause, making sure I have some bend in my elbow, roll it or toss it back. Once I get my five, now I've got my glove on. Same exact thing that we just did, except for this one that's straight on. I'm gonna use two hands. I'm gonna funnel it in and separate. And the reason I wanna separate one, just to get that feel, work on quick hands. Um, and the reason I want to separate, I want the fingertips down palm down and elbows up. So and the reason for that, when we feel the ground ball, we feel funnel, get to separation, and then throw. So I wanna just separate palms down, elbows up. So straight on, my fingertips are down, glove is open to the ball. I'm gonna field, separate, roll back. Field, separate. Once I get my five, now I'm going back to my glove side. I've got five, then I'm going backhand. Five. Once I get those five now, um, we're doing short hops. Depends on the age of your girls. Um, normally, I just do short hops. For my older girls, if we're doing a team, if we're doing lessons, sometimes I'll incorporate the short hops. Your discretion. But once you get your five ground balls, now you'll do five short hops, pick straight on. So you got five straight on, same exact thing, going to meet that ball. You've got five glove side, and then five backhand, really making sure that your head is staying still, your chest is staying down as you feel that pick. Once you get those, now we're standing up. Same exact thing now standing. Making sure now, my position when I feel the ground ball, my back is down, or my chest is down, my back is flat, I'm in my legs. I don't wanna bend at my hips. My eyes are right behind my glove. So partner's gonna roll me a ball, five straight on. I'm gonna use two hands, funnel, separate, toss. Funnel, separate. Once I get my five, go on glove side. Notice where, my, where I'm at in my body positioning. I'm bending in my knees. My eyes are right behind the glove. I'm gonna go meet that ball, and I got backhand. I'm going to meet that ball. Once I get those five, now we're gonna go short hops. Same thing as when we were on our knees. I wanna make sure that I'm only using my glove hand. And this will look like full speed. So I'm just gonna show you three reps of each, but normally I do five total. 